हेलो स्टूडेंट टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू सॉल्व एन आई एस थ्री थ्री जीरो कंप्यूटर साइंस क्वेश्चन पेपर ऑफ अक्टूबर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी टू मैक्सिमम मार्क्स इज सिक्सटी एंड पासिंग मार्क्स इज ट्वेंटी टाइम ड्यूरेशन इज थ्री आवर्स ऑल क्वेश्चन आर कंपलसरी सी लिंक एट डिस्क्रिप्शन फॉर प्रीवियस ईयर सॉल्व क्वेश्चन पेपर वन डिफाइन सॉटिंग टू अरेंज द एलिमेंट ऑफ अ लिस्ट इन असेंडिंग और डिसेंडिंग ऑर्डर टू Explain normalization in database. Normalization is the process of analyzing the data to be represented and breaking it down into separate table in accordance with principle of relational structure. Three, define programming language. A programming language is a set of rules that provides a way of instructing the computer to perform certain operations. Four, what is HTML? The hypertext markup language is the standard markup language for documents designed to be displayed in a web browser. 5. Define the term relational database. Database is an organized collection of data. Relation is the collection of data corresponding to the same kinds of entities in a database and relational database stores and provides access to data points that are related to one another. Six, contrast between data and information. The word data is the plural form of datum, which means facts, observations, assumptions, or occurrences. Information can be defined as data that has been transformed into a meaningful and useful form for be specific purposes. Seven, differentiate between DDL and DML. DDL data definition language consists of those commands that create modify and remove objects in a database DML data manipulation language consists of the commands used to retrieve manipulate and update data in present database 8 contrast between physical versus logical records a logical record contains all the data related to a single entity It may be a payroll record for an employee or a record of marks secured by a student in a particular examination. A physical record refers to a record whose data fields are stored physically next to one another. It is also the amount of data that is treated as a single unit by the input-output device. Nine. Compare between procedure-oriented and problem-oriented language. high level languages are often classified according to whether they solve general problems or specific problems general purpose programming languages are called procedural languages or third generation languages problem oriented languages on the other hand require you to instruct the computer in step by step fashion fourth generation languages also known as problem oriented languages are high level languages designed to solve specific problems or develop specific applications by enabling you to describe what you want rather than step by step procedures for getting there 10 what is communication system the communication system is a system which describes the information exchange between two points 11 name the header files to the function gates belong studio.h 12 name the header file to the function puts belong Studio dot h thirteen explain the term data hiding. Data hiding is a property when the internal data structure of an object is hidden from the rest of the program. Fourteen define class in C plus plus. Class is a user defined data type. Class is a template which incorporates the de declaration of its data members and member functions or methods. Why is one simple illustration class student? Class student, character name size, int roll number, public void gate data, void put data. Fifteen. Write a C plus plus statement using switch case to display odd digit or even digit and not digit otherwise. Pause the video and see the answer. Sixteen. Explain nested if else branch statement. If condition is statement one, else statement two, statement three. If the condition is true, statement one is executed, followed by statement three. If the condition is false, statement two is executed, followed by statement three. 
इट शुड बी कैप्ड इन माइंड दैट स्टेटमेंट वन एंड स्टेटमेंट टू कैन बी सिंगल और कंपाउंड स्टेटमेंट सेवेंटीन राइट अ फंक्शन सी प्लस प्लस टू प्रिंट द सम ऑफ ऑल ओड नंबर्स टिल हंड्रेड पॉज द वीडियो एंड सी द एंसर एटीन एक्सप्लेन द कंटिन्यू एंड द ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट द ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट कैन बी यूज इन अ स्विच स्टेटमेंट एंड इन एनी ऑफ द लूब्स इट कॉजेज प्रोग्राम एग्जीक्यूशन टू पास टू द नेक्स्ट स्टेटमेंट फॉलोइंग द स्विच आर द लूब सिंटेक्स ऑफ ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट वाइल कंडीशन स्टेटमेंट वन इफ कंडीशन ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट टू स्टेटमेंट थ्री द ब्रेक स्टेटमेंट स्कीप्स रेस्ट ऑफ द लूप एंड गोज आउट ऑफ द लूप Continue statement. The continue statement is used in loops and causes a program to skip the rest of the body of the loop. While condition statement one, if condition continue statement two, statement three, the continue statement is skip rest of the loop body and start a new iteration. See link a description for previous year solved question paper. Nineteen. What will be the value of sum after the following program is executed? Five hundred. 12 20 write the output of the following program true 21 write a function verify in c++ that accepts an alphabet and checks whether it is in upper case or not pause the video and see the answer 22 predict the output of the following program syntax error 23 Define a class employee with the following specification private members employee code numeric employee name string division string organization string public members a constructor that initializes all numeric members with zero and all string with abc get data function that accept the entire data so data function that display the entire data pause the video and see the answer 24 Consider the following class definition and answer the question that follow. 1. Which type of inheritance is shown in the above example? 2. Which all data members are accessible from my input function? 3. Name the member function which are accessible from the object of class my bags. Public derivation. Following data members will be accessible. Private care m bag name 10, float weight, protected int number change float price public care choice following member functions will be accessible protected void call price float void bag input function void bag so function void my input function 25 write a program to find the average number in an integer array of size 10 pause the video and see the answer 26 explain implicit and explicit type conversion in implicit conversion, data type can be missed in the expression. Example, double A, int B is equal to 5, float C is equal to 5.5, A is equal to B into C. It temporarily changes a variable data type from its declared data type to a new one. It may be noted here that type casting can only be done on the right hand side of the assignment statement. T P is equal to double salary plus bonus. Initially, variable salary is defined as float but for the of calculation it is first converted to double data type and then added to the variable bonus 27 declare a structure date having day int month int year int thereafter create another class employee having the following members employee code of type integer name of type string date of birth and instance of date date of joining and instance of date write a c plus plus statement to accept the value of date of joining from the user and print the complete record on the screen pause the video and see the answer 28 give a c++ statements to do the following one create and float pointer fptr float asterisk fptr to make ptr hold the addresses of an integer variable through pointer type casting int x fptr is equal to float asterisk and percent x 29 Assuming the class service center defined below, write a user defined function to read the objects of service center from the binary file service dot that and display the records of only x, y, z brand car. Pause the video and see the answer. 30. 
एक्सप्लेन मल्टीपल एंड मल्टी लेवल इनहेरिटेंस मल्टीपल इनहेरिटेंसेस अ डिराइव्ड क्लास विथ सेबरल बेस क्लासेस इज कॉल्ड मल्टीपल इनहेरिटेंसेस मल्टी लेवल इनहेरिटेंस द मैकेनिज्म ऑफ डराइविंग अ क्लास फ्रॉम नैदर डिराइव्ड क्लास इज कॉल्ड मल्टी लेवल इनहेरिटेंस थर्टी वन डिस्क्राइब एनी थ्री इसेंशियल करेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग क्लाउड कंप्यूटिंग हैज सेवरल की करेक्टरिस्टिक्स दैट डिफाइन इट फंक्शनलिटी एंड कैपेबिलिटीज वन ऑन डिमांड सेल्फ सर्विस यूजर्स कैन क्विकली provision computing resources such as virtual machines and storage as needed without having to go through a manual provisioning process to broad network access cloud resources can be accessed over the internet from anywhere at any time using any device that has internet connectivity three resource pooling cloud providers pool resources such as servers and storage and allocate them to users as needed See link at description for previous year solved question papers